In today's tutorial, I'll show you how to do these metallic rose gold snowflake nails using chrome powder. To get started, I've already prepped my nails and cleaned them of any extra oils to make sure the gel that I'll be using applies properly. For this manicure, I'll be using the Uno by Gelish Mini Polishes that don't require a base coat. I applied one thin coat of a red polish, then cured for 30 seconds in my LED lamp. This particular lamp I'm using is from Vanity Planet and I have a pretty good coupon code for it in the description box below if you're interested. After the first coat cured, I followed up with one more layer for a nice opaque color, then cured one more time. Chrome powder applies best over top of a no wipe gel top coat and even though this Uno polish doesn't require top coat, I went ahead and applied a no wipe gel over the red gel just to be safe. After that's cured, it's time to apply the powder. I'm using the chrome powder from What's Up Nails and to get a sheer color, I'll be using the flat side of a cosmetic sponge that's not super porous. I picked up a small amount of powder on the sponge, then just wiped the powder over the nail, making sure to get into the edges, around the cuticle, and on the free edge. After that, I applied another layer of gel top coat to lock in the chrome and then cured. The top coat I used here does have a sticky layer after it cures, so I removed that with a little bit of nail polish remover on a cotton ball. Next, I'll be using white acrylic paint and a long liner brush to make some snowflakes. I started with three rays extending from the corner of my nail and added two small branches on each side of the rays. For my middle nail, I did do a couple snowflakes, but on the other nails, I just did one and I mixed up the placement. Then to finish the snowflake, I added a dot of white to the end of each line. I sealed in the snowflake design with one final layer of top coat gel, cured, and that's it. If you enjoyed this tutorial, let me know by leaving me a thumbs up, and if you have any Christmas or winter nail design ideas, let me know in the comments below. 